Hello everyone, Rob is now here taking a look at the Liftoff Pro League tournament stuff. Uh, we finished the Muddy Tryouts tournament, um, well done to Control for getting a sub one minute time there, that's really good. Snuck in a top 10 time for myself, so really really well done to everyone that took part in that. Uh, really uh, pleased with how that went, like I kept coming back to it with that uh, tryout every day feature, I really like that. Uh, the Spinfast is a new one, this is on, in honour of the CBIT uh, Computer Expo in Germany, Hanover. As such, it's set in Hanover on Hanover Track 1. You get two tryouts every day, so it should be really cool to see how the uh, leaderboard changes as everyone figures out the best drone setup for this. Uh, because it is going to be a case of finding out a drone setup that works well for you and is very, very fast. Battery management is not on, God mode is disabled, so you do need to make sure you don't crash. Um, and it's just a case of flying as fast and as smooth as you possibly can. Um, and I've just realized I haven't adjusted my camera angle on this drone cell yet. I'm running with the Talon, with the Darko motors, the really aggressive props, um, and a 5S battery because I'm not in purist mode and I'm not got battery management on. If you do have battery management on, you're probably just going to crash out around here. Uh, because it is the sort of track that you can just full throttle it all the way and it's just about making nice smooth transitions uh, with the turns like if you can get your turns down you're going to be fine the only tricky points I find are the end of this sort of pathway through the park because you've got some trees that you need to avoid um, and then actually just this checkpoint like it I miss that checkpoint quite a lot and I don't know why I think it's just the angle of it and the angle I'm approaching it at um, but other than that, it's just a case of getting the practice down, memorizing the course so you know uh, what lines you need to take to be fast at it. Um, on, on that note, it's just a case of you know flying smooth and fast and not crashing. So just uh, get a drone your, your, uh, for, if you just want to set a time, pick a drone you're familiar with and you, you are comfortable with and fly, fly the track. Um, make sure your battery management is off because I did try this a few times. Uh, and realized that battery management was on by default because that's how I run the, the game. I just prefer having it on just because it gives me that sort of sense of, yep, that's enough uh, flying. There we go, that's how you finish, get through that gate well. Um, the top time is 1.47, that is impressive. I mean, I know I wasted some seconds missing a checkpoint, but 1.47, I'm not even halfway through the, the final lap. Um, so like it's it's a case of finding out what setup is is doing those crazy speeds um, and finding much much faster lines because this drone is maxing out at 100 mile an hour with the assistance of gravity every now and then I'm getting um, 101 um, and it's just a case for me it seems to be a case of finding a line uh, that's just just fast because like two minutes seems to be what I'm hitting, two minutes 20, something like that every time. Um, so it's just a case of getting a, finding what setup works well. Like I've tried the 5S battery, the 4S battery, the Adarco motors, the, the Extor motors, different props. So I'm gonna, next thing I'm gonna try is the frame, move to the coal frame, which is slightly lighter. So that might increase the speeds and see what happens. But um, there you go, that's the tournament. Um, and just before I sign off, I would say I want this retry button when I'm in the tournament to be tournament lobby instead, just so I can go back and compare my times when I'm practicing if I wish to. Because uh, that's like, have that button there as well as retry. That would be cool. That would be really, really great. That's my quality of life feature that would would, would make me very happy. Uh, but yeah, really well done to Focus to Rage for a 147. That's just super fast. Like impressive stuff um and yeah uh, good luck to everyone that takes part and i'll see you next time take it easy